fight the... Oh, we also got here, we went to Dwarf Pharaohs. Actually, before I forget, let's go back and kill that stupid lizard. I'm actually gonna switch over to the Great Sword because... This has a down slash attack. That stupid lizard. I hate him. He taunts me all the time. Unless I've got anything to hit him with. Yeah, but that'll probably lure him away. Never mind. Uh. Hey. Yeah, I know what some of you are asking. Why don't you use stupid, uh, great sword more? Because it's too slow. I like to swing a bit faster. So I can just do this. Yeah, one shot. Just knock his axe away. So, that's sweet. I know you can do that. Let's quickly smack him. All right. Good job. Old Monday in the snow. Uh, Monday is upgrade path that allows you to. It skills with your lowest stat, basically. So if you're one of those people that pretty much just go 20 across the board, then yeah, go ahead. It, it's not too bad, especially when you do a mundane Avalon. That thing is just overpowered, man. What? Capture card. Stupid caps card. Was your fault? This more. So we got three large Titanet charge. Hey, buddy. Give me. Ah. Plus five. Much better now. Just for the fun, fun of it, we're gonna use a human FG to restore our HP. You know, in my opinion, I'm doing this a little backwards. I usually start with the center, then head to the gutter, then head here, then iron keep. I'm gonna do a little backwards. We're gonna head here first. Oh, uh, what do you drop? What do you drop, my friend? Play a butterfly. Hey. What is this? Oh, Blade Warrior. I said Blade Warrior. Good job. You're in a medal. Being an idiot. Alright. Hurrah! Through here. We got, we got some more stupid people. Come out. Come out now. Actually, you know what? 
Oh, yeah, I do have throwing knives on me. Okay. Good stuff. Eh. 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 Next. You know, do poopy damage. Wah! Ooh, spiders. Spooky. Yeah, you can guess what we're gonna be fighting next. Very ominous looking room, huh? Well. Do that. Bunch of giant spiders come out. These things actually have a chance to drop the Mastodon Greatsword. Their drop rates are just really broken. I don't know why. One of them dropped a Great Scythe for me once. One of them dropped Ricard's Rapier. Mastodon Greatsword. A Zweihander. Like, their drops are so broken. Oh, we dropped... No. That's a troll, man. Alright, whatever. <laughs> Watch, it would have probably been the Mastodon Greatsword, too. Knowing my luck. Alright, whatever you do, don't roll into that pot, because if you do, um, it's a water vase, so if you roll into that, your electric uh, defense goes down. Enemies in here. Shoot. Lightning bolts. Oh, I didn't know he was going to do that right away. Okay, we need to heal. Alright, come on. Whoop. Goodbye. Hello. He's saying this is an extremely easy boss. Yes. This is a boss. This is the pinwheel of Dark Souls 2. It does become uh, a normal enemy later on, so. Yes. Alright. Easiest boss ever made. And we get a Titanite slab. Up here. Here is the guy. Here we got a bonfire aesthetic. Cleric small shield, which actually blocks a lot of magic. And I think you can parry away magic too, which is pretty cool. Um this guy you have doubts. Oh, about sorry. Skimming dialogue. I am Cromwell. Regret. Yeah, Cromwell, he basically this relieves you of all your sinner or sins. Wonderful gifts they are. Together, they are the essence of life. Don't you agree? So yeah. But now you're lost, bewildered by your own actions. You poor little thing. Yes, yes, how Tiny and frail are we. And you're a dick. Now is the chance. Demonstrate your sincerity to me. Yeah, he's a partner. He also buy the white priest head. Traditional headpiece for the Dragon Leg clerics. Clerics of the Dragon Leg were not viewed with particular reverence, and their positions were only preserved as a nod to tradition. It's customary for clerics to wear different garb depending on their sex, but the reasons this practice is unknown. This is a men's headpiece. This is a men's robe. This is a men's gloves. This is a men's skirt. I don't know. Alright. By the way, men's don't wear skirts. They're killed. Thank you. That's the Scottish term for it. What if you want the freaking English term called a man's skirt? Alright. B -b 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 Bonfire.
Quick question, how many Titanite chunks do we have? Three. I think we can actually get up to six here. Now this area can be annoying. And I say can. Um up here, this is a bonfire by the way. In this room. Drop down that hole, there's gonna be a bonfire. We're not gonna hit that up. We're actually gonna kill these stupid guys. I'm be quiet. And we're gonna drop down. Uh-uh. Not the spiders. Let's kill them real quick. Drop me something. Both of you. Drop me something good. No? Alright. Fine by me. Not upset or anything. Yeah, don't ask me. This door doesn't even have a handle. And I used like a fake handle or something. I don't know. Don't ask me. I can create the game. Right. Wrong house. Uh, this is the house. You'll see later. We'll come back to it probably. I'm gonna make a boss weapon. Hello. Just basically gonna run this way. Tighten that junk. We're actually going to homeward bone it because we're gonna take a little bit of a different path. I use bonfire, why? These stupid things? Or am I getting invaded? Oh, yep, yeah, told you. I can drop some handers, man. Kind of ridiculous. Alright, so we're basically gonna spawn back up here. And up here. Oh god, I'm getting spam, man. Hold on. Sorry about the notifications, but. You know. We. Alright, so you gotta be really careful about this because there's a stupid lizard. No! I'm gonna miss the chain. Yeah, of course I did. Ah, these things are so difficult to get. What you me? Come at me. Thank you, tough. Large? Yay. Need one more. Uh, yeah. This guy's not fun. There you go. Sit there. Be a good boy. It doesn't do much damage, but hey, uh, it's damage, right? All right, come on, come here, come here. Come here. Yeah. Die, please. Asking politely. I think the pickaxe is actually a really good weapon. Uh, never used it because. I haven't led the stupid pig to a certain destination, which is in there. 
Wah! Drop me a large. You didn't drop me anything large. <laughs> All right. Four million spiders at your service. Okay, that. <laughs> ah! Exactly. Drop me. Master on greatsword, come on. I know you can, and I know you will. Oh, I hate this game. What is this? Yeah, Homeward Bones, yay. Never have too little of those. Except when you get the aged feather, it really doesn't matter. Alright, come here. What? Yeah. Alright. Uh, we have enough durability for this fight. Now, I actually have a little bit of backstory for the center because I've been learning a few new things about this game. When we fought the lost center, that little. When we fought the sinner, uh, a bug crawled into her eye, and yes, it is a she. Um, ow. Oh, I can't go this way. Move. It's a lot of spiders. Um, the sinner, the bug that crawled in her eye, is actually uh, a bug from the Witch of Isolith, which was inside the um, Bed of Chaos. So, we're quiet now. I'll tell you a little backstory about this boss after too. Hey, see how that's a dragon head? Yeah, well. No. I used to be a dragon. So, Duke's dear Freya, or Freya. Sorry, I, I know how to pronounce its name now. So, so Duke's Dear Freya. A little bit of backstory. I'll tell you after I kill the boss, actually. Yep. Kind of messed up, but you know. Come on, shoot your laser. Shoot your laser. Fire your lasers. Hold B to charge your laser. Up. And the backstory behind the Duke is really interesting. Or at least from what I know. Is this Dark Souls 1 is actually heavily linked to Dark Souls or Yeah. Heavily linked to two, so sorry, I got my wording messed up. I need to flask it. Ow! Scumbag. Should really kill off these spiders. But no, I'm too much of an idiot not to. It's gonna hurt in the morning. He's firing his lasers. So it's actually a pretty easy boss. So I say that, and then I'm gonna die. Little stupid spider. 
hate these spiders. Go. Well, it's the first time you got to see that attack. Um. Yep. Fire lasers. Thank you. Alright, let's not get cocky. Oh. All right. So backstory behind the Duke. Um, pay close attention. We don't we don't embrace a great soul when we kill the Duke. Now, you see this dragon here. Now, if you play Dark Souls One, come here. And if you come here, New Game Plus, or if you burn a bonfire aesthetic at a certain bonfire, I mean, come here. And when you kill the duke, you get the Pale Drake soul. There's a dragon here, which highly resembles Seath, the scaleless from the first game. And, uh... Yeah. Basically, Seath could take form of anything. And, uh, he changed forms after he died into a giant-ass spider. So, yeah. Here's Lord Seldora. And there's no more Lord Seldora. We got another fragrant branch of Yor. And if you guys remember Vengarl saying how he only needs a head, well, there's his body. And this the body has no poise whatsoever. So you can just stun lock him into oblivion. Ah. You get his armor set. Not bad, but so yeah, that's that's all I got for today about that. Um, really interesting. If you come back here way later in the game, you can actually enter Seath's old memory. I think it's pretty cool, but. Yeah, uh, we're gonna use Soul of the F Dear Freya. Freya. This gives me a buttload of souls. Um, I'm never gonna make the Spider Tooth or whatever Spider Fang, cause really, I'm not doing dexterity, so that weapon's not that good either way. I only hope it. Yes, we've killed two out of the four main bosses that we need to kill. I can level up a lot. Ooh. Uh, no point in continuing. Strength. I don't know. Faith. Escape for miracles. Heavenly stuff. I have a lot of vitality, man. There. We'll pour some stuff into vigor. Alright. It's gonna do it for this episode. Also, I'm gonna get another Estus Flask. Hope you guys enjoyed though and uh subscribe if you want to one more thing guys potato